please excuse this terrible lighting? How is everybody? I figured I'd do a reading for this video. Because I feel called to. And I'm so tired. I don't want to say the word slut. Spirit wants me to share this message with certain people, um, take, take this if it resonates with you, um, if it doesn't then leave it behind, but we're just gonna draw some cards, I normally do an ASMR video, but I'm gonna do a little reading, just to switch things up. Let's just see what Spirit has to say to us. Oh. <laughs> I was debating if I should go live or not. I was debating that. I was like, should I go live? Maybe. Maybe next time. I might just do a live. Do a live reading. Would be fun. Alrighty, let's see what we got. Two of Swords. Ace of Wands. Hmm. Four of Coins. A Fool. Judgments. Star. This is crazy. So, let me situate myself here. Alrighty, so you guys who are receiving this message, it's very good. You have fool. also have judgment and you have the star all major arcanas then you have four of coin you have ace of wands You have two of swords so I want to start with the two of swords because that was the first card that came out I want to start with this two of swords what's this two of swords here universe is saying so whoever is watching this this is the message universe is trying to tell you with this two of swords you have two choices you see how she's like holding the swords she's weighing them she's trying to see which path is better for her this is what you need to do you have two choices two options you're being presented with and universe is asking you to make a choice now you have libra energy there you also have moon energy so there's you know there's air energy right swords are air energy so libra gemini um and what's the other sign oh my gosh aquarius but you also have the moon there which is water energy right that's pisces that's intuition that's your emotions okay with this card i see that those of you that are watching this video that have been led here you need to make a choice and your universe is saying you have two choices and universe is saying to weigh your options but with that moon there you need to recognize that you're making this choice through your intuition through your heart through what 
your soul is calling you to do. <laughs> it's crazy because with the Ace of Wands, this is like starting a new project, something that's really going to take off, something that's just going to... And you see the volcano erupting in the background. It's just something that is very passionate and extreme. It's a lot of fire energy, okay? Something that's going to light you up. It's going to give you life again. You're going to have new life. And also abundance. But first you have to make a choice. The universe is asking you to make a choice. And it seems to me like... Let me get this card. It seems to me like this is almost like a business idea. Or like you're moving somewhere, or you're doing you're doing something different. You're doing something different. This is not something that is in your comfort zone. You're stepping out of your comfort zone. You also have four of coins here, so this is eventually going to leave you abundance. But it's almost like you guys have been through this, like, I feel like most people would agree with this, but like this issue with money, like money has not, um, it has not come easy for you guys. And, you know, you get to this place, but you're also very, like, you're, you're very serious about your wealth, your newfound prosperity and abundance. You know, you're opening up your safe. Um, but at the same time, you're not too eager to share with, you know, people. And I'm even talking about your friends and family. You're not too eager to share because you remember, you, you look at his facial expression here, you remember the struggle that you were in. And so this time you're, and this isn't bad, but you're being selfish. You're putting yourself first. You're making sure that you have shelter that you have food okay you're, you're making sure that your financial situation is secure and you know before you help anybody else and you remember the struggle you see his facial expression here you remember that struggle with finances maybe you were homeless maybe you were living in a motel you were living out of your car not by choice because some people do want to experience the van life right but maybe you ended up living in your car and not by your own choice. And just know that it's okay for you to be selfish once you get to this place to protect what you have worked so hard for. It's so important that you make sure that your needs are always coming first. Also, you have the sun. So you have sun energy there. You also have Capricorn, so you're really going to be grounded in your finances. You're going to be grounded. You're going to be in, con in you're going to be in control. You know, with that sun uh, symbol up there, you're going to be in control. Is what I feel like of your finances and of your financial situation, and you're really not going to take any risk in terms of lending your 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 prosperity and your abundance to other people, you're going to be very much like, <laughs> you're, you're going to be very, very privy on who you tell, I, because I get the feeling you guys aren't going to share this. Even with your closest friends and family, you are not going to share that you have acquired this, this newfound, abundance and wealth i feel that you guys are going to keep it quiet you're going to keep it silent and then for the people that will eventually find out right you know if they come over to your luxury apartment or your house that you just bought they see you driving your newer car obviously they're going to assume that you now have extra money lying around you know what i'm saying the point is you're going to be very privy if people your friends and family 
if they start asking you for money, you're going to be very, very, uh, I don't want to say harsh or cruel or cold, but you are going to have boundaries and they're going to be very hard. You're not just going to lend people money. You're not just going to, oh, well, here you go. Here's money to fix your car. Here's money for your rent. Here, You're not doing that. I see you being very, very serious with your finances. So, so these two cards go together. They tell a story. And this card can also go here because it's like you're embarking on this journey. You have to make a choice. It's outside of your comfort zone. And Part of that is following your heart and your intuition. But what I feel, this card, is that you do make that choice to follow your heart and intuition. And then you have these three cards here. So the Two of Swords is kind of like the, the bridge, you could say. And you have the Fool, so let's talk about the Fool here. Right? He's balanced on a ball, there's a rainbow. The fool is like going out there into the world, experiencing new things, just going out there with an open heart and open mind. And that's what I feel like it's gonna happen with you guys when you make this choice. But what I also feel, you know, and I see this, because you have these two massive arcanas here. You have this star, which is new creation, new beginning, new life, and then you have a judgment. You guys have been through some shit in your past. You have been through a lot of shit, and people that did you dirty, uh, they're gonna receive some bad karma. I know that in our human nature, we, we don't wish that on anybody, we, you know, we, we don't want to wish negativity on anybody but the thing is this is this is one of the laws of the universe this is one of the laws of the universe this is how things go around here you know don't dish it if you can't take it is my saying because it's gonna come back to bite these people these people that it seems to me like an uh, abusive i might be stretching it a little bit but a not so good relationship for a lot of you with a spouse. I, I really get that. Also, some of you, it was your career, your boss, your co-workers were toxic to you. They were not good people. They brought you hell, basically. For some of you, you were laid off without a word. They just called you. They said, don't come in anymore. Drop your uh, keys at the front of the door, at the front office, and, you know, it's done. We don't need you. And I feel like you guys have felt like you were treated unfairly. And Universe is saying, don't worry because these people are going to be judged. They're going to get, their karma is going to come back full circle. And you're going to hear about it. You're going to hear about it, but don't get involved in it. Don't. Don't, don't reach out to anybody, don't, just keep moving on, just know that universe is pretty much showing you, look, this person, remember how they did you dirty, remember how they did this, their karma has been served, and you're just gonna be like, oh, okay, and just keep it moving, don't try to re-engage with these people, don't, just, it's, do you know monopoly go directly to jail do not pass go do not collect 200 right yeah don't try to engage with these people these people put you through a not so great time i get the feeling i get the feeling that some of them are even physically abusive towards you and <clears throat> there's just no reason to go back none whatsoever so that is your reading that is the message that universe 
wants you to hear for those of you that come across this video. Like I said, you're 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 at this place where universe wants you to uh, make a choice, make a choice, and they really want you to follow your heart and your intuition. The 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 idea that you have is something that can completely take off, and it's gonna leave you in a place of financial abundance. With that comes you embarking on a new journey and creating a new life for yourself and also karma to those people that did you bad in your past. So those of you who have come across this reading do not lose hope, okay? You can change your situation around completely and it is going to go so good for you so whoever you are i hope you have received this message make sure to comment down below if you resonate with this okay this is the end of this reading and i wish you much blessings peace and abundance namaste